Ladies and gents, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going somewhere different, somewhere I've never been before. I've drove past it, that's about as far as it gets. But uh, it's certainly a killer. It's certainly got loads of steps leading up to halfway and it's certainly gonna ruin me. If that's your cup of tea, stay tuned. Watch a fat man weep. Welcome to Dave Outdoors. Chin chin boss. Cheers, Cheers everybody, we made it. Absolutely bollocks. Linkau up on Kadere, just what a place. It's um, absolutely rammed here though as well. Look at all the tents. What a place. As you've probably seen coming up though, it was absolutely brutal. Them steps were, I had to stop, go again, stop, go again. It was horrendous. Felt sorry for John having to wait for me all the time, but yeah, with uh, like five cans of beer in the rucksack as well, certainly old you down. But what a fantastic place this really is. I was just saying to John as well, if it was gonna be two nights, I'd do one night here. And then I'd make my way up onto Kader Idris for the second night, just up there. I think that's gonna be for next year though. I'm gonna finish getting my tent set up. The time is now half past six. So yeah, I'm gonna get set up, get myself all sorted, the wind's picking up. And then yeah, hopefully we're gonna uh, get some tea on. I've got something different tonight. Looking forward to trying it. So yet again, then I'm in the Banshee 200. Bloody Lanshan still hasn't turned up. I don't know what the friggin' hell's going on there, but it's been almost, well, almost four weeks now. But yeah, Banshee 200, I was out in that in Storm Ellen. That'll probably be in the last video. I haven't even touched it yet. Yeah, it's like a honey pot round here, which I haven't got a problem with because it is a beautiful spot. But if you haven't seen already, look at all the amount of tents that are here already. So I'll try and zoom in. But just over here, you've got your uh, you've got your family-sized uh, camping tent. There's three of them. A couple of other wild campers just turning up along the ridge here, and then you've got a couple of stealthy guys here. In fact, the one guy here, he's got a drone. He's just been out flying it. And then me and John are just here. And then you've got a couple of other guys here that I believe have just been smoking some green. Um, and yeah, they're in some half-decent tents as well. There's one tent just here. You might see. And the best spot of all is somebody just here in the dip. That looks an absolute corker of a spot, that does.
So I've just had to wrap up a little bit. It's getting a bit chilly up here. The wind's coming in as well, which is making it bad. But we're still just chilling out here, admiring the view. And I still think that these guys over here are smoking green because, uh, yeah, I can smell it. But if I turn the camera around, there's a few more wild campers turned up as well. It's getting like a bloody Heathrow Airport up here. And the footpath for just coming across the lake is... The footpath for coming across the lake is just here. And there's just been a lady and a gentleman that have just passed us. Probably my similar age to me. And the tent, the lady was carrying, it was huge. It was like one of these family camping tents. Um, not really sure where they've pitched up, but it was huge. And if she's come up Caddy Ridge just carrying that, I salute you, madam. Anyway, I just want to give a quick shout out to Jonathan from uh, My 24 Hour Adventure. Shout out to you, brother. Hope you're well. Um, if you're not yet a subscriber of Jonathan's, go and check him out. He's like the most calmest dude to ever walk this planet. Um, if you watch one of his videos, you'll be hooked. So go and check out his video, cracking guy, um, really soothing way in front of the camera. But on a recommendation of John, thank you ever so much, Squire. Look at that for a view though. Kader Idris, come and visit. So tonight's choice for tea, courtesy of my little one, is macaroni cheese. So we'll get tucked into this. First time I've tried this one, so we'll see what it's like. And then, yeah, we'll... Uh... Sounds nice. I'll give you the verdict on it after. So I'm just waiting for my meal to rehydrate. So as you've just seen, it's macaroni cheese. Leading on to that, um, if you haven't really bought off the Fell store yet, head on over to the Fell store where they can offer a nice 15% discount using the discount code DAVEOUTDOORS15 where you're going to get 15% off any purchase. It's better if you buy in bulk though. And I know John, he's, he's bought, he's spent quite a considerable amount of money with the Fell store. So John, what have you got for tea tonight, mate? I'm on, um, I'm on beef stew with pear barley tonight. Um, I'm hoping it's going to be good. So we'll see, it's the first time I've tried it. So, ladies and gents, I don't know if you'll be able to see me, but uh, it's getting quite late now. Still a little bit light. You might not be able to pick it up on the GoPro, but we're just sat now by Linkow, ready for our last beer. And that'll probably be, I'll probably do a little bit in the tent later on, but what an absolute epic trip it has been so far. Absolute killer, as you've probably seen coming up on the, uh, up the steps there. But uh, we made it, took our time coming up. And obviously we're graced with these, uh, Lovely views, we've got Cad Air Ridges just up here. Well, ladies and gents, it is that time again. It's been a fantastic evening and it's time for me to go to bed. So the time is 20 past 10, that's all. But I feel a little bit zonked. So I'm gonna hit the sack. Gotta be up early in the morning, gotta get back home more DIY to be done. This evening has been great. I've been down on the little pebble beach down here on Linkow on Cadet Ridges with John. Had a cracking evening, cracking jokes, good bit of banter. So yeah, it's been uh, overall a cracking evening. But time for me to go to sleep and I'll see you lovely lot in the morning. Good night. is quarter to six good night's sleep wind picked up in the night just having a quick coffee in the vestibule oat bar for breakfast we've both got to be back pretty sharpish this morning so we're, uh, we'll have a coffee have an oat bar and then slowly pack away but it's going to be a lovely day again today have a look right behind me
And so, as always, leave no trace. No trash, no trace. Anyway, we were good camp, we've all finished now, and we're about to make our way back down to the car now. It's only about half six, but uh, it's gonna be uh, an early start we've gotta get back for. So uh, we'll see you a little bit further on. So we're almost back at the car now. Thanks ever so much to John for joining us. Cheers. And uh, I'll see you on another non-lockdown adventure with me, Dave Outdoors. Au revoir. <laughs>